This video will show you how to quickly connect to a Microsoft Fabric warehouse using SQL Server Management Studio, otherwise known as SSMS. My name is Greg Beaumont. I'm a technology professional for data and AI at Microsoft, working with healthcare and life sciences customers. If you'd like to reproduce the Fabric warehouse shown in this video, you can do so using a Git repo that I put together along with my colleague, Ender Rana. The link is included in the description of the video. Looking at this diagram, we have the Fabric Data Warehouse being used as a gold layer, and I will connect to that using SQL Server Management Studio in order to demonstrate how that works with Entra ID, which is the identity-based access to the Fabric Data Warehouse. If you're already using Microsoft Fabric, you might be familiar with this web-based view of the Fabric Warehouse, and you can see that I'm previewing one of the tables in the warehouse. If I move back to the workspace and select Settings for the warehouse, you'll see that I have a SQL connection string that I can copy to clipboard. Now you can see that I've opened SQL Server Management Studio, SSMS, on my desktop. I'm gonna be connecting to a database engine. For the server name, I will paste in that string from the Fabric Warehouse browser. If I drop down the authentication options, I will select Microsoft Entra Multi-Factor Authentication, MFA. There are also some other Entra options, but MFA will give me secure identity-based access to that Fabric Warehouse. I have my username blurred out here. And when I hit connect, you'll see a browser window opens up. I use my identity to log in. And you'll see I get a message that authentication is complete. Moving back to SSMS, if I expand databases, you'll see that I have my Fabric Warehouse that we just viewed in the browser available here inside of the desktop SQL Server Management Studio tool. If I were to preview the same table that we were looking at in the browser, I will select top 1000 rows, and we get a preview of the top 1000 rows. Some of you may prefer to work in the browser, but if you like having that desktop client and the robustness of SSMS, this is another option to connect to the Fabric Warehouse as if it were a SQL Server. Again, if you'd like to have your own Fabric Warehouse populated with real open source data, the repo is linked in the description below. If you get a chance to like this video and follow the channel, it would be appreciated. Thank you.